Hello Libra, welcome to your tarot card reading. My name is Isabel. Today we're going to be discussing what you can expect in love for the month of May 2018. Now, if you haven't already subscribed to this YouTube channel, then you can click the subscribe button. And if you would like a personal tarot card reading, you can get one at thetarotempress.com. So, let's see what you're dealing with. We have the Hierophant Tarot card in the overall energy. Some of you guys are hoping for commitment and stability. Some of you guys are very keen on following a traditional approach when it comes to a relationship. For some individuals, you could be dealing with a Taurian individual that is a Taurus person. And they could be, you know, looking to settle down with you, looking to have a future with you. In the challenges position, we have the Seven of Cups indicating some of you are dealing with a lot of choices and options. The Seven of Cups can also indicate for some of you guys that this is a period of time in which there's a lack of focus and commitment for some reason or the other. In the past, you had a lot of love coming into your life. There was a lot of, you know, positive flow in terms of your relationships and your love life. What's coming towards you is the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this represents a marriage offer or an offer of commitment, something more stable and steady. So you met someone, they fell in love with you, and now you guys just need to focus and stay committed to this because, you know, love is something that is, you know, going to prevail in this situation. Nine of Cups is in the gold position. You want to get all your wishes fulfilled. You want everything to come true, all of your, you know, your dreams and your hopes, etc. The Five of Pentacles is in the root of the issue. Some of you could be going through a difficult time. It could be financially or it could be, in some sense of the word, you have a drainage when it comes to your finances. So pay attention to the Five of Pentacles there. It can also talk about the fact that you are neglecting yourself and or this person is feeling neglected. Now, in your attitude, we have the Six of Swords tarot card in reverse, indicating that some of you are feeling stuck in the situation, like you can't move out of it, like uh, there's very little movement, etc. Six of Swords tarot card can also indicate that you might want to take a holiday or something or a vacation, and right now it's not a good time for you to do so. So it can mean that for some individuals. So their tarot card is in the external influences. There's a lot of changes and transformations coming into your life and this can involve your love life like if you uh, were single or you were just you know newly in a relationship or been in a relationship for a long time and you're entering this new step or this new stage of your life where you are going to be getting married then the death tarot card is indicating that that is the change and transformation it's the end of your, uh, your time as a single and independent person three of cups is in the hopes and fears position you're hoping to have a blast you're hoping to socialize you're hoping to have a lot of celebrations with this person the Sun Tarot card is in the outcome position and it's very positive for you. It means that everything you've ever wanted is going to come true. All your dreams are going to be realized, you know. So don't pay attention to the Five of Pentacles because if you're worried about certain things that are going on in your love life, just know that it's going to clear up and everything is going to work out very wonderfully for you. A lot of positives here, a lot of new beginnings for you guys. Two aces, right? Even the, the tarot card, changes and transformations, new beginnings, celebrations, a lot of positive, positive things that are going to be going on in your life for the month of May. So I hope you're excited about that because, you know, you guys are one of my favorite star signs. Have a wonderful day. And if you would like a personal tarot card reading, you can get one at the tarotempress.com. Remember to subscribe and to like this video. I'll see you guys soon. Take care.